a vehicle went through the whole building. So a large portion of Medmark Treatment Center in Milford has been destroyed after a car came crashing through the front lobby. Brenda Ordonez is live after talking to some witnesses. So what happened there? Patricia and Megan, witnesses that work in the area tell me they felt the ground shake and thought a bomb was going off. Now, others say that it's really a miracle that there weren't more injuries and that no one was killed because they say this area is always congested and flooded with people coming in and out. That was the first time I've ever seen like that, and then you feel kind of helpless because there wasn't anything I could do. William Kubich joined frantic witnesses outside of Milford's Medmark Treatment Center after a car crashed into the building Wednesday morning. I think someone's run over by the car, so we definitely need an ambulance. Milford police confirm a person was pinned under the car. I think her left ankle is trapped under the, the front bumper. She's talking. She's really shaken up. 911 calls revealed bystanders worked together to help the victim until EMS got there. They're tying my belt around her leg right now. Police say the victim was eventually freed and taken to the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. As for the driver, police say the person is in their 60s and suffered minor injuries. They note a probable cause of the crash was pedal confusion. They say drugs and alcohol are not factors in this crash. Medmark Regional Director of Operations Malia Naylor confirmed the driver was not a patient of theirs, but would not disclose if the victim who was pinned under the car was a patient or employee. She does note, though, that this incident has temporarily halted services at this center. She says patients will receive messaging as to where they can access their services as the center works to rebuild what was destroyed. Yeah, now as you can see, the treatment facility has been boarded up. Medmark says they're not sure what the timeline looks like as to when they will reopen. For now, live in Milford, Brenda Ordonez, Fox 19 Now.